So you've got 36 hours to enjoy what Southern Living has suggested your new favorite small town. Dahlonega, Georgia, just an hour north of Atlanta, this charming town boasts not only the site of the first American gold rush, but is also home to the Appalachian Trailhead, award-winning wineries, lively festivals, a university, and the largest waterfall in the Southeast. So let's get going because I have six minutes to show you your next 36 hours. Are you ready? First things first, the Dahlonega Gold Museum. This historic landmark sits right here in the center of town, built in 1836. This is a history lesson you don't want to miss. Want to try panning for gold? Then check out the consolidated gold mines for a 200 feet underground gold mine tour. Here at Shenanigans, your quintessential Irish bar. Here you're gonna find great pub fare, fish and chips, friendly atmosphere, and walls that are literally covered with customer autographed dollar bill signs. So much character packed in this place. So check out Shenanigans, where you might run into some possible uh, shenanigans. Another great thing about Shenanigans is that it really has become a true public house. Wanna grab a coffee? How about a cozy cappuccino right next door? When looking for a place to stay, why not check out the Airbnb properties of Stay Delonica? They have houses, they have cottages, and you guessed it, they have tree houses. Rise and shine. How about a nice piece of fresh quiche for breakfast? We're here at the Picnic Cafe, and the Picnic Cafe is absolutely a hallmark here in Delonica. Owned and operated by our local mayor. I mean, it doesn't get much more hallmark than that, right? Ready to choose adventure? Because just a few miles north of town is Preacher's Rock. This is a two mile track on the Appalachian Trail with some stunning views. So come on, you got this. Here at Spirits Tavern, we have the best burgers in North Georgia. With names like Rude Awakening, Dragon's Breath, and The Bearded Goat, coupled with a premium bar and a uh, everyone knows your name atmosphere, you're definitely gonna wanna have Spirits Tavern on your go-to list. Who doesn't love a little retail therapy? And in downtown Dahlonega, there is something for everyone. From antique stores to art galleries, clothing boutiques, and outdoor sporting gear, we got you covered. Welcome to Number 3 Vintage, known for their eclectic and well-curated vintage finds. You'll love browsing their treasure trove of unique antiques, home decor, and handmade jewelry. This is Blue Gallery, an out-of-the-box art gallery featuring vibrant, one-of-a-kind works from paintings, jewelry, and pottery. You best bring your appetite because the Smith House has been serving up hungry travelers since 1898 and they're not about to stop now. Southern comfort food at its best, served family style and trust me, no one goes home hungry. I firmly believe every small town needs a neighborhood playhouse and Dahlonega's historic Holly Theater built in 1948 is just that, offering both musicals, plays and live concerts. The Dahlonega Mountains are recognized as the heart of Georgia wine country. So assign a designated driver or hire one of the local shuttle services and get a taste of the Napa of the South. This is Cavender Creek Vineyards and Winery. I just love the relaxed but sophisticated atmosphere here at Cavender with beautiful outdoor areas and intimate indoor seating as well. And some friendly locals to boot. What do you love about Dahlonega? Everything, absolutely everything. This is the best town in the whole country I'm within. Frogtown. Don't let the name fool you because this 57 acre vineyard is serious about their wine and they have the credentials to prove it. Winners of numerous awards, premium portfolio and picture perfect views. Three Sisters Vineyard is proud to be Dahlonega's first family farm winery. Situated on 184 acres of mountain beauty with a relaxed atmosphere and a very tasty port I might add. Drink local taste Georgia and enjoy Three Sisters. So in Dahlonega, we just recently got our AVA. Uh, we're the Dahlonega Plateau. That means we're a, we're a legit wine growing region right now. Um, at Three Sisters, we're 100% estate grown. All of our grapes come from our property. We don't buy any grapes from anybody else. And um, we're growing a lot of interesting stuff. Enjoy the panoramic mountain views at Kaya Vineyards. With a breathtaking setting, the Kaya team loves to produce handcrafted, complex wines that cater to the serious wine enthusiast. So we're back in the square and I feel like my sweet tooth needs a little pick-me-up. Why don't we check out some of the sweet shops in town? 
Paul Thomas chocolates. I wish you could smell this goodness. Like a Tuscan villa set in the Italian countryside, this is Monteluce, with an upscale menu and a wine list to match. When the weather is right, sit outside in the veranda for sunset views over the vineyard. Can you say, bellissimo? It might have been referenced in a country music song as a little dive bar in Dahlonega, but the Crimson Moon offers an authentic live music experience in the second oldest building in the square, circa 1858. And you never know who might show up the likes of Sean Mullins or Indigo Girl's Amy Ray. Not your average dive bar. Every great getaway deserves a killer brunch, and Wolf Mountain Winery and Vineyards is known for just that. Their beloved Sunday brunch is rivaled only by their stunning mountain views. And with all this goodness, what a great way to wrap up our 36 hours in Dahlonega. For more information, visit Dahlonega.org and discover for yourself why Southern Living calls it the best small town escape. Dahlonega, Georgia, it's pure gold.